And we are back. Hello, everyone. Hello. Okay. Alarm sigil, sniper sigil, two energy, one, one. Like, it obviously represents a card, but I don't know how it works yet, so it might be a puzzle that we get later. Yep, good. Let's attach it. This thing lights up when you have gem vessel cards in play. Your empty vessels are now filled with gems. Check it out. You can change the color of the gems you draw from your side deck. Try it, press one. You'll pick a card now, and I'll gemify it. And then on, having a green gem will increase its health. Having an orange gem will increase its power. Having a blue gem will lower its energy cost. You'll see. Oh shit. Ah, uh, what do we recommend here? We can get a double gunner out faster. We have a blue gem. Do you want a robot? Alright. What do you think? Green, orange, reduce costs? That's what I'm thinking too, because we can already increase its attack when it uh, dies. Let me recalibrate. We want the blue one. See those things in the corner? They light up when you have the right gems. You'll see. Oh, okay, so it doesn't matter which one I have out, as long as I have it out. Okay, I see how it works. I already had two energy. No man, that's fine. She's gonna come down and kill herself anyway, so we're good. Right. Next turn, I can play the. Oh, I don't have a. I'm gonna draw a uh, emerald vessel. I might be able to play the. Uh... Another ruby vessel. I can't play the robot yet, so we're gonna play this guy. Let's just drop him here. It's fine. What? Okay, I see how it works. That's fine then. I won anyway. You know what to do. Alright, Wind Trade, we can do it again, but with a different card this time. What do you recommend? We can make a sniper bot stronger? We can make a sentry bot stronger? Quill? Double gunner? Might be good to give one of the lower cost ones something, just so that uh, we can get a benefit from it early on. 
Should we go with the one with the random effect or the one with the no effect? Okay. What do we have? There you go. It's gemified. Oh wait, hang on. Can I click on these up here too? No, oh, these don't do anything. Alright. Gem Guardian. Dora's Vessel. Vessel Finder. Once a card bearing the sigil is struck, draw a card from your empty vessel pile. Ooh. That's not terrible. This guy is, when a card bearing decision is played, all gem vessels on the owner's side of the board gain nano armor. That's also super good. While a card playing this is on the board, it provides an orange gem to its owner. Okay. And a green. Alright, so these are all pretty good. Like, this one here is, you pick one or two. I'm thinking this guy here. All right. This is less than ideal. There's nothing I can do right now. I don't have any I can put out. I could put him out, but then I just get one energy back. I wouldn't have enough to put him out as well. So, what do we do? Sniper bot. We can put him out, and he can start wiping out enemies. One damage cards here, guys. Better hurry. That's the plan. Another sniper bot. That's not going to help. Stopped it from exploding. You are a hero. Is that enough congratulations? Star on my head again. Oh, a traveler. These parts do not seem many. You wish to pass these blades? Fine. Uh -oh. Take some money. You might be here. So this is... Okay. Well, Wintry, we get to add another buff. 
Cool. Add it to Sniper Bot. Sentry Drone. Anya, Double Gunner. Pick whatever. All right. Well, I think we should do it with the double gunner. Play gems to power it up. What is this? Uh, let's do this first. Choose a card. Okay, we get to buff a card now. So what should we add a buff to? Add it to the 49er again. We get another one to the, another double gunner. Another me bot, maybe? Or, if we could get, like, instant death on the sniper bot, that could be sick, too. I think we're gonna go with sniper bot. Alright, we can get reflect, anti-air, and what the fuck is this? When this card, uh, Bane Sigil, its owner chooses a creature to grant... I uh, gain nano armor. Alright, well, that's less exciting. Alright, well, we're gonna have to give it reflect. Reflect is always good. You had 36 injections today, but you feel much better? That's good news. Loading 0606.entry. Found this. Found this old picture of an. of when Elle and I first got into. Aquarelmans. Gilly Gladiator. Sick. Elle got a Julius C star. Interesting. Okay, so it's the same thing. I don't think the archivist would dig, would dig up this file. Or I didn't think the archivist. Okay. Is there nothing else down here? a trade. Someone to go over here? Oh, there is. Okay. I got a pelt. What do I do with that now? We trade the pelt, maybe? I can't see what's in my deck, so... I give you a card, give me one, it's easy. Gleam's Vessel. Pick the one you hate. I could trade my non-buff double gunner for his buff double gunner. What do you think, Wintrigue? I can also get rid of Skelly Latcher because I don't really care about this one, but it does evolve into a wolf or something, so it's not bad. Okay. 
This guy's giving me a sniper buff that's already buffed. Um, Gorange's Vessel and Orlu's Vessel. Now these just give me gems when they're on the board, whereas this guy can just attack. And my empty vessels, they, they're pretty abundant, so honestly the sniper bot might be another one that's worth it. X, what would you pick out of these? Orlu's Vessel, Gorange's Vessel, or Sniper Bot? I'm kind of leaning just Sniper because the uh, empty vessels already come with these things. Although these guys do give bonuses of like more than just one gem. So this guy would buff everybody that has the gems attack and uh, defense. Whereas this one would lower the cost and increase the attack. So it'd be really good to use with uh, Ouroboros. Let's do that. Alright, what we got here? It's another one of these. Okay. Why that guy have two attack power? Let me block. again. That maybe okay. what I'm thinking. I'll drop the shield bot. Here. There you go. And just in case, I'll drop the sentry drone. That should kill off Casey. I will tell my future children of this moment. We will laugh together about it one day. Uh, he'll kill my shield bot, that's fine. I'll play a shield bot by my double gunner. We got it. Yay! Items 100% recharge, bot spawners offline. Was a satellite. Okay. I don't know what that did, but sure. If I click it again, does it do anything different? Oh, I can't click it again. Okay. The guy who used to live here was a major drag. Oh, I'll admit, he was not dull. Guy had a plan for every eventuality. That is, except for the Great Transcendence. Let me go here and buy something. Right, we're up. 
What is this? 25 Robux for whatever that is. Alright. I'm going to spend 10 Robux and we're going to add a buff to one of our cards. Rindrig, you're up. What do you think? What do you think? Alright, well, thank you for your input. You make the Lonely Wizard better by adding something to him. They have Roblox Robux making it into the game. Alright, so he can have plus energy, which might be nice. Uh, random. Or, ooh, stinky. I think we should go with the stinky. Alright, now we know why he's lonely. He's stinky. I, I did, it was just the, uh... <laughs> they, they only give three. What is this one here that's worth 25 Robux? Robobux. I don't want to uh, spend on that unless I know what it is. Alright, well, let's just go out here. All right, we got this dude here. There's one. Will she transform at the end of my turn, or will this guy get to move down and attack? I'm just gonna put her over here to kill that for now. Oh, okay, I see how this is gonna work. Alright. I can still play this, so may as well get some extra damage out there. Let's take out this thing, because it does a lot of damage. Buff another one of our cards. Okay, let's see. You know what? I kind of want to buff Quill. Let's buff Quill. What do we got here? Out of the deck, into the hand. Oh, 
I only have one energy because of that. Okay, that's fine. Well, he costs less now because of that, so we're going to put you on the field. And I'm going to put you on the field as well. Shit. Oh, that works. Doesn't matter. It's fine. On the next turn, I'll be able to pick a quill. Popping Quill is probably a really good... What is this? Oh, it's a... Recharge. Okay. Guys, join next for a boss fight. All right. This Uber bot. Well, you'll see. Is this going to rewrite my cards? There isn't one. There's no boss for this level. That's your job. Please, paint me a face. Um, hey guys, if I Sephiroth, the one winged angel, you won! Wintrig, which eyes do you want? This big eye? Right, let's give him these weird ones then. Alright, works for me. I am born! I feel as though I can breathe now. So much to see. Blank boss, make rule. Great game. Super smile. Another thing, I will need a special power. A game rule to call my own. You painted me such a beautiful face, so please. Every time you play a card, every time a card dies, every time your turn starts, Um. Alright, the next, since I skipped ahead there, what should we do? Every time you play a card, a random card takes five damage. I play a leap bot. One of my cards gains nano armor. All cards take one damage. A random card is played. You lose one life. Plays a leap bot. That's probably like the least dangerous of them all. What are we dealing with, X? In nano armor, all cards take one damage. A random card is played. You lose one life. A random card takes five damage. I play a leap bot. This one here. That's what I'm thinking. Might be the easiest one to do. Let's try that. Good. This could work. Let's see how this plays out.
Okay. Yes, attack. I don't want to play him though because I might he might die and then I'll lose him forever. I should save him for now. Exactly what I was thinking too, X. You picked such a cool mechanic for phase one. I think we should elaborate on that design process. Ooh, okay, so now we gotta do a different one. Cards gains nano armor, maybe. All cards take one damage, a random card is played. I think we should try this. Every time you turn sides, a random card is played. Drum. Well, this is kind of shitty. He's gonna blow up all my stuff. Not much I can do about this. One more. Let's see how this plays out. Every time a card dies, you play a leap bar.
That setup I was automatically gonna win anyway. That was pretty cool. I got the painter servant. Servant. Six nine, yo. We can guard against flying, <clears throat> we get a bonus shield, or we can have it attack. When a creature moves into the space opposing the card bearing the sigil, they are dealt one damage. That is actually sick for an empty vessel, I think. What do you think, Winchick? We got uh, air defense, we got extra armor, or if anything moves into the square with an empty vessel, they take damage. Air defense, uh, extra armor, and uh, sentry. So the first time I take damage, it would prevent that damage. I'm thinking sentry, yeah. Alright, we're going to take a break, guys, and then it'll be the last 30 minutes of today's stream. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> 